Google Cloud Next 2017 has hosted a plethora of talks detailing the future of cloud. If you didn't get a chance to check out Mete Atmel's talk, Running.net on Google Cloud, then stay tuned because here's the recap. Historically, .NET and Google Cloud Platform haven't exactly played well together. Uh, the reasons for this are complex, but one of the biggest challenges has been around the language and tooling not working very well with scalable Linux VMs. But, brace yourselves, that's no longer the case. Improved Linux support for the .NET environment has allowed the framework to extend its reach. And the availability of Windows VMs on Google Compute Engine opens doors for new types of applications to run on Google infrastructure. See, the decision to run .NET on GCP is no longer an issue of features and support. It's about choosing the best cloud platform for your needs. And when it comes to .NET development, GCP has some new features to help you be more productive. Let's start by looking at the libraries and tools. We've provided a suite of runtime libraries that make it easy for your application to interface with the full suite of GCP services. That includes everything from the Vision API, Natural Speech API, Authentication, and Data Store, all available for your .NET app. We're also providing Visual Studio plugins and PowerShell commandlets to help you manage your GCP resources from within the tools you're already using on a day-to-day -day basis. On the compute side of things, we've got support to boot a VM with Windows on it. But we also go further by offering Google Cloud Launcher, which gives you one-click deployment to Windows servers that come pre-installed with things like ASP.NET and the Google Cloud Platform .NET libraries. But if you've already done that legwork yourself and are running, say, a container with Windows and ASP.NET Core on it, don't fret. You can deploy that with ease using App Engine Flex Environment or our Kubernetes platform, Google Container Engine. And the best part is that all of this is running on Google's infrastructure, which already offers fast VM provisioning, simple auto scaling, and per minute billing, uh, not to mention access to managed services like a big table, data store, data flow, cloud storage, and genomics processing. GCP also provides a federation of tools and services which make your deployments production ready. The health check system can monitor your instances, and a fully expanded and accessible auth and IAM system allows you to control who and what has access to everything. Plus, there's integration to Stackdriver, which gives you logging, reporting, tracing, and monitoring of your cloud service right out of the box. Check out the recording of Mete's full session to see a bunch of cool demos of ASP.NET running on Google Cloud. And if you want more recaps on great Next content, make sure to check out the rest of the playlist. And don't forget the Next World Tour, which is coming soon to a city near you.